Yo, hello. How's it going? Uh, welcome to the Invisi Frame live show with myself situated here. And and myself situated here. Toddly Robinson. And you've got us yeah. just as my wife has turned up and delivered the food. No way. Which is good, isn't it? A bit of a reflection with the light on. Can you sort that one light out? Push it over that way so we don't see it in the mirror. Bit more, bit more. That's it. Good lad. Okay, so have we got any chat? Who is watching? Oh, he's arrived. Why is wow. he here? Um, Hello. <laughs> you all right? oh this was a hundred pounds from Asda. We are live, by the way. Oh, so I'll be on the live. Yeah, I'll be on the live, yeah, but just. Um, Are you with your dad? Are you following on? Uh, I don't know how to say hello to people. Thank you very much. This is Leo Freighter. Race Cruise. Race Cruise. Miss McPeer. Oh, Nick. Okay. Yeah. Okay. You want what? Oh, you've got a Chinese. This guy wears a tooth gum. Bill Headbutt of me. Yes. Oh, you lost it again? Yeah. I'm meant to be having to put it back in that again. Oh my god. You had a little uh, Chinese? Mm, Chinese, you want a bit? Yeah. Help yourself, mate. Help yourself. So, I told you hardly on the screen at all. It's um, an busy frame, a live show, live from the pinned residence in Shrewsbury. Live or, from the pinned gap. As we call it, Shrewsbury, because we're not posh. Got someone saying yeah. hello. Hello. Have, have you seen that Jackson Goldstone's on the syndicate? Yeah, saw it today on Pink Bike's uh, email. And Rory Leanland. There was mm. an email, really? I don't know what I am on. I get emails off them. Uh, famous. Famous man. No, I don't know if it's, like I don't think it's a media friend. thing. I think it's just you can sign up to it. <laughs> and you send it Some out to the subscribers. Letter. Yeah. Mm. Um, have so, you heard Leo Freitas on race co? Yeah. yeah, what's happened this week, Leo? I have just been to pick up my new rig, and it's amazing. Have you ridden it around the garden that you haven't got? No, I've ridden it around the car park at race co. The amazing shop. I definitely suggest that you head over there. It is amazing, the shop so, they've got. I hear they've helped you out with a bit more sponsorship as well. Uh, Can we talk about stuff yet or not? Oh, nice. What? What is it? Uh, <laughs> that's just chocolate. It's just chocolate. Corn. I hope it is. Um, no, nah, not really. Oh, okay. Give it a minute. Okay, so we can't talk about Red Bull. <laughs> you can't talk about Red Bull Monster. Can't talk about monster. Red Bull Monster. Monster, monster Bull. <laughs> uh, I am on your night. Mm -hmm. That's for sure. Yeah. Uh, and... There's obviously other stuff coming later on. It's just all sorting out because obviously stock are low. Hello, yeah. five man, by the way. Who else is on there, Todd? I see anyone I can read. Lee Morgan Artworks was on. Is he? All right, they will be seeing you on Monday, won't we? Are you getting a day off school? I didn't know about. Hey? Uh, I mean, are you, yeah. are you feeling ill? Yeah, I'll be feeling ill. Sam, Monday, let's go to that. Um, Where are you going? I'm going to drop the. Um, Full face helmets off to start on their road to Paintston. Where is that? Is that Oswestry I thought? Oswestry, yeah. Yeah. Man with a memory. What? They're going to paint me a tooth? Yeah, they're going to paint me a tooth. It's so weird seeing you out too fat. Little Nip Do you like my 100% nitty? So, I've got you some more sponsorship. Did you see a box on the table? A big cardboard box? Nope. Do you want to go and get it? And bring it in here. Uh, I really, I really kind of think you know what it is. Mm. Hopefully it works better than that door works, Todd, that he's just shot on the light. So I'm all dark now. Who else is there? <laughs> um, Nicky Giletti. Hi, guys. Good to see you all. Um, Nicky, did you... Did you get, or are you still getting the Bull Terrier? I'm sure you are in a minute. He's in there going wild, but uh, yeah, he's 
he's about double the size of when he last saw him. And happy new year, everyone. Happy new year. Yeah. Did everyone have a good right. Christmas and all that sort of stuff. I didn't actually expect this. So this can be a live shut the door, sunshine. Unboxing, is it? Yeah, live unboxing. So sit it on there. Don't you sit on there because it collapses. Pretty obvious what it is. It says Fenwitz on it. Thank you, Jim Bago Cannon. Give me fist pump now. So I <laughs> rang up John from Fenwick. I said I got another one for you. Ditch all the other ones you've helped and were useless. Got this one. And um, no. <laughs> yeah. Within um, well, within two days of speaking to him. In fact, it was yesterday I phoned and spoke to him. He got up to us super quick. It's like Amazon. So yeah. He's fully sponsored up. Really got the uh, tell people what bike you've yeah, actually got. Shit, I, want I want a gold too. I might, I might tell them what bike you've got. Um, it got. is the most amazing bike I've ever owned. It's a specialized S Works for like the, the top 2022 mo model. I'm sure you've seen on the pinned Instagram. I didn't realize it was a 22 model. Yeah, brand new. Wow, one. They're, they're so new, there's not even any reviews. Out. Really? Yeah. Are they any different? We could do a review. Yeah. There you go. That's First ride review. Where are we going then tomorrow? I don't know. Not me. Obviously, I'll show you in a minute. I broke my hand. Um, I'm not going to get a new special. It's so cool. Oh, oh. I've already got all these. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm joking. It's happy, though. So you got the new brushes there, which are now... Oh. Actually, on the website, we've been testing some of these out for months. Not that one, though. That's a new brush. We haven't got one there. Um, but we had to keep ours quiet. <laughs> That's the one that was at that race, wasn't it? That's the one that would be good for your um, rear cassette. I'll be asking you rear cassette. That'll oh, yeah. get right in. That's the chain one, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. What is that? They do a hand cleaner. That's brilliant. Off your hand. No, it's you so wouldn't. good. How's it cold still? Hmm? And clean up? Because he literally... Because he didn't put it in the microwave before he sent it. Cool. Okay. Uh, anyone who wants to get some busy frame stuff, right, put um, the code uh, pinned15. Yeah. And you get 15% off. they got loads of stuff in there, haven't you? Yeah, thank you, you so much. See you right. Wait, I'll brush it. Um, that's going to be part of your um, go on, part of your vlog tomorrow, Todd. Oh, talking cool. about this stuff, okay? Yeah, I can. Got to show the uh, gratitude. I've got some Can we get Dan on here? Yeah, yeah. Got him back there. Dan Freighter. Do you want to go on the line? Do you want to go on the line? Nobody's met Daniel Freighter yet, oh, which is um, your this is daddy. He's too scared. Hey? Oh, he? Yeah. Will he not? Will he not come on? No, no he will come on. He's gonna get him. Thank you, magic. Oh, you, you got the camera wrong. Thank you, Jay. You're nearly cut off. Mm -hmm. A little bit more your way. Dog madness. Dog madness. Too many dogs now. Hmm. You can see them all. There we go. I've only got what, too, Rodney? Not many. We're pretty low at the moment, aren't we? What, read out some comments and shizzle. Um, I think Mr. Leo Freighter has Christmas at least 12 times a year. Mm. Yeah. Who's that? Ashley, right? Mm. Ashley, but right. Anything else? There's loads on there. Evening, gents. How's the hand, Jibby J? From? From Andy Omer. Uh, it's sore. I've been working like straight away, went straight back to work. And yeah, I've been like digging, carrying wheelbarrows, carrying bloody bricks and um, yeah, big pieces of stuff. And it's not very nice, but it's very, very slowly getting better. But it is going to be slow. No more have you when you have. Good. 20 quid I paid for that hat. Sick, then. Eh? Not bad enough. 
thought I'd mention it. That was a proper hip hop hat in the eighties. That was in America. It was sick and all the break dancers used to wear them. Sports Direct. Yeah. <laughs> um, Mitch, Michael Edwards, I used to hit out of Compton or Shrewsbury. <laughs> <laughs> Full grip. Straight out of shoe spree. Shoe spree. Um, Crazy. Hey, mate, we haven't got our bull terrier yet. Should be getting it mid year. And happy new year to you all. Happy Thank new you very year much. To you as well. Mid year? Well, yeah. You must be waiting on a litter then in the future. Huh? All right, all right. How's it going? Like, would you like to come on our live oh, it stream? It smells delicious in here, to be honest with you. We are currently live, obviously. Oh, yeah. oh we'll have a little kit in here. So this is um, Daniel Freighter, Leo's dad. Say hello. Poor me. And uh, <laughs> he's a man who, unfortunately, has to deal with that lunatic. Well, I've beaten him to shape, you know, so far, mm. uh, even though it's illegal. Yeah. Um, you know, so I try to drag him up the best I can. But now, now it's your child that comes around and causes mischief mm, to be a mischief, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, it was a good, a good, uh, good visit to race today. So they're looking after you a bit more. Yeah, they're absolutely brilliant. They're really, really on form, very accommodating. You know, lots, yeah. of, lots of knowledge, and they've offered you know help with the downhill bike as well, which is cool. Yeah, however, oh, they? yeah, they've got a good setup there. Yeah, three vans with three private plates. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I well, yeah, they know. They know how to sell bikes, don't they? They do very much so. And I've never really looked at specialised stuff that much, probably because it, I don't just not not been around. But when you when you're in there and you look at specialised oh, quality, helmet, the seams are perfect. Everything's yeah, absolutely everything. bang on. I mean, specialised is like you get what you pay for, don't you? You're not getting mm. get a absolutely cheap yeah. you, but then yeah, it's high quality. Yeah, very much, very much so. Yeah, yeah. Mm. So yeah, we just need to go home and set the suspension up and have a play with it now. Really, I think. Would you say it's like the Mercedes of the bike world? I would definitely say it's up there, isn't it? Mm, yeah, yeah. I would definitely say it is. And uh, even when you look at the linkages, you know, and pivots and stuff like that, you can tell that mm. you can jet wash it without a problem. You know yeah. what I mean? <laughs> Whereas I took my capper apart the other night, and it's like, oh, there's no seal but the seal on the on the, on the actual bearing. Yeah, <laughs> you know, yeah. where Specialized have really kind of weatherproofed the whole rig. I think really. you don't really. Uh, you never, I mean, everything breaks, obviously, but it's very rare you hear of a specialised break, isn't it? Like some bikes. Absolutely, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. But I think the follow-up will be good as well, you know? They're happy to yeah. uh, get involved at any point. Well, um, the UK brand manager, who is Georgia Leslie, uh, I tagged her in that post on Instagram when it said that you were in it. Sit there, dude. Can't see you. And uh, yeah, she was like, her comment actually was, "This is rad." Than you know. Yeah, why am I smaller than you now? Because you like, <laughs> yeah. Her comment oh, this was, "This is rad." So that's cool. So that? yeah. Georgia, she's brand manager, specialized. and uh, I commented back saying, "I'll help you out, help mate. Help, help you out, I'm you. really full." Nah. Bit of duck. Uh, uh, my comment was, "I wanted to make you aware of it. That's why I tagged you in it." And you see how many likes that got that post? Eleven hundred. I know. I saw. Mm. I had so many um, people asking ask questions as well from that. Mm. No, it's mad actually. To be fair, I didn't realise so many people would actually care. Yeah. So the all riders as well. You know, they're like I think there's a few guys from the shop ride into at Dubby yeah. on Sunday, and they're like, you know, we're, we're going to go up to Dubby on Sunday, so. Uh, be up there and stuff, and you can't miss the race coast sticker, can you? No, bright yellow fluorescent. <laughs> yeah, and the, um, <laughs> I'm sure they won't mind us saying we were, we were talking to Atherton Bikes about getting him on there. It was too early for that, really. They, they, you know, they, they're just trying to do too many things at the moment, trying to get their website launched, and then trying to get guests. Trying I to think get I would have been waiting out. a while for a bike. Well, you're trying to get bikes out with no components still. Yeah. And uh, and then Raceco jumped on and said, "Look, we can sort him out," which was amazing. But Dovey Bike Park, to be fair, my mate Dan, who owns, who's like manager of it all, said, "Look, we may not be able to take him on, but he can keep coming to Dovey Bike Park for now." It's always something for the future. So they're looking after you there, aren't? So that's where you're going Sunday, isn't it? Yeah, Sunday, so, most weekends. Which bike though? Both, I think. Oh, yeah. Both. Yeah. Mm. 
Yeah, that specialised will eat the trail up there. Yeah. That's um, the idea of it, I think. I think for like less techy tracks uh, on the Pierce um, series especially, I can just use that instead of the downer rig. I can't get used to him with a tooth It's missing. really it hard to really see. really weird. <laughs> <laughs> go, go a bit closer to the thing. We've got, got a gold one coming. We've got a gold one coming. Don't go dead close. Yeah. <laughs> Do you know what? I, I, <laughs> you know hard the... Speech. Like really hard. I you know the out. theme you know tune that. for Pims, that dum dum yeah. dum dum. Yeah. The bloke who sings that, Zeb, is a singer. Well, obviously, a singer. He's uh, also a dentist, and really? he does gold teeth. And I can get them at like half price. <laughs> get a full-on gangster gold tooth. I really want a gold tooth. How stupid! Told me about seven hundred quid. Really? Mm. For one. Mm. And you can have them. Um, you can have something written on them and all sorts. Yeah. Super yeah. cool. I'm sure that the priories love that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, <that's> cool. <laughs> we got any more um, comments, Rodney? <laughs> any questions? What's the nosh, Jim? Looks tasty. It is a uh, Chinese and I'm having chili fried duck. I've had a lot of lemon chicken and a lot of noodles and I'm really full. Yeah, I'm really full. Because I've been Not hitting the uh, diet this week. I love you. Yeah. Nothing too serious. Right. It's a Jimmy Jim diet. <laughs> the Jimmy Jim diet is very simple to do. All it is, is normal food. Don't eat after six o'clock. Yeah. That's the strict one. Yeah, that's the uh, says eating dinner at eight o'clock. Yeah, yeah, let me finish. <laughs> Don't eat after six o'clock. No unnecessary food. So no crisps, chocolate or biscuits. Yeah. And fry one night and eight a week, Friday. It's like a cheat day where you can eat what you want. And that's my, that's it. And uh, I tell you what, doing that, it's the easiest diet to do and the weight drops off you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can imagine. And yeah. no, don't drink either, except for on your cheat night. Because drinking's the worst thing. It is. You did eat a massive lump of cheese last time I came around here, though. What? Mm. Well, that was quite, you know, quite oh, yeah. there. That was before. Yeah, right. Right. Anyway, it's nothing wrong with yeah. 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 That's before the diet kicked Yeah. yeah. Well, yeah. I'm, I'm the thing is, you're not riding. That's the thing, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, you're exactly. not out there riding. But you're, you're pretty physical at work, aren't you? Yeah. That helps. You know? Oh, we didn't see the Sam Croft foot on that. Helps a lot. <laughs> yeah. What else we got, Rodney? Any more stuff? Ashley Bite asked if Sam Croft beat Leo up. No, I'd, yeah. knock, I'd <laughs> knock him out. I'd knock him out. <laughs> yeah, I don't know about that. They couldn't reach you that far down. No. <laughs> <laughs> Um, how long will we be off the mountain bike, Jim? As little as possible. I'm going to go. It's been. Why has it been a week? Uh, I did it on New Year's Eve. Week at, and a bit, I think. At work, uh, with a drill, and I'm going out on the gravel bike on Sunday for my first ride. But it'll be just down lanes. Yeah, yeah. I've been working all week. It's savage. It's so hard today. I'm going to dig a trench. And you cannot, you can't go like that with the shovel. So you've got to yeah. put the shovel where you want it and then push it in with your feet, which is all right. So you've got like rocks and you need to cut an edge. So yeah, I've had a frustrating, painful day today. Yeah, you've got a very physical job. <laughs> That'll probably mean it'll fix itself up a bit quicker maybe then. Well, it? everyone says about physio oh, and about, yeah. about using it more, but you can't use it more than going to freaking work no. having a manual job. Can no. Oh, no. And when I you're riding, there's a lot of pressure like, on that. When you're riding, riding thinking, just yeah. riding more is like almost done most of the physio for me. Funny, isn't it? Because in the old days when we were young, every, all the doctors all said to you, rest it, rest it six weeks, eight weeks, don't do anything. Yeah. Whereas now it's like, get it moving as quick as possible. Yeah. Totally I mean, change. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Mm. I like the resting side of it, though. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Take a week off work, go to the pub at midday. Nah. That's what they used to say to me. <laughs> Not anymore. Now they carry on going to work and work harder. I can't do I that. think it's just no money. <laughs> I'm skinned if I don't work for a week. <laughs> there is that. <laughs> so is it a weight off with you, with him being sponsored? Is it a bit of a weight off for you? Sort of it, it is, it is because so much investment oh, yeah, goes into sure. it, doesn't it? You know? Well, mm. I've fed all my skills into him over the last 10 years. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, I've got pictures of Leo on his bike. With oh, uh, yeah. you know, though. jumping off, jumping off benches in the quarry yeah. when he was five, 
You know, he, couldn't, he couldn't just ride through the quarry. He'd see a bench and oh, get his bike on it and do all that. Search yeah, up on YouTube, Powers 000. Yeah, I don't know if you want to see all that. Show, right? no. <laughs> no, no, actually. No, no, no. <laughs> but it is, isn't it? You know, you want to. It's now early on at this point. Yeah, yeah. where we need. Especially, especially an accident. <laughs> you know, with yeah. any bikers, if you hurt yourself uh -huh. at any point, you're out of the game for a few months. I know myself because I don't ride as much anymore as than I like. If you're off your bike for a month, you feel it straight away. Yeah. Don't you? Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, you feel it in many ways. So I um I really struggled when off the bike. Yeah. Mentally more than anything. Yeah. My head goes a bit. Yeah, it's a relief for you, isn't it? Mm. Um, Can't they create some bike related machinery at your work? Yeah, I know. Where it's like yeah. Jim's wheelbarrow bike. I, yeah. <laughs> I'm all right I'm now. I, I like snapped out of it after about I had four days where I was like full on virtually depressed yeah you might say that word but i was, no, really. you know enough, yeah. I was pretty miserable you know you've yeah. got to go through that grind don't you with an injury yeah. as well you yeah got to, you've got to get there through there somehow so so yeah onwards and upwards i think it'll be a uh thank you wifey you good three months i'll have a small one of those if possible is that yeah. all right Mom, can I have a glass of yeah just a little one thank you. yeah not in a jar like moonshine <laughs> i'll have mine in a wine glass <laughs> 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 Uh, any more comments or questions, Rodney? Um, what clothes did we used to run before I am? Uh, God. I don't I, see Royal. I was Kingdom. Royal. I was Royal. He was His never... tomato Royal kit. Oh, what did you, you had some? I had Royal. And then we went through said drives or whatever I was getting mm. my hands on. But uh, Dumb wooden weights have they got it. Yeah, show it show him on the camera. <laughs> Hyper dog. He's a bit manic right now. <laughs> it's a beast. Just he might, have, to, he might have to be sent out in a minute. He might get a bit too much. Yeah, he's gonna eat all that. Yeah, yeah. He's gonna well, get that. He's seen food. Yeah, it's just... he's seen food. Have you had <laughs> enough of that, Todd? Have you had enough of that? Hello. I want to eat it later. Hey, I'll just right, I'll take it, it out because it like just it. Won't, won't stop moaning about it. Um, Keep talking. Say some stuff. And stuff. So. Danny Frodo, bit of background on Danny Frodo because he's never been on this channel. What's your job? He has been on a channel. Yeah, but he was Oh, I just do very player. little. Very little is what I do. <laughs> Man, I was working today, actually. We went to pick yeah. the bike up and yeah, I had a job in Birmingham, so it worked really well. He's got a because, pretty cool uh, job. I'm going to say what a job he did. Well, he's very modest. Where he makes antique mirrors. So it's like you make them look like antique, don't you? Yeah, I hand silver. Yeah. Which is something, it's a dying trade, really. It's not many people still do it. But you start with clear glass and with a bit of alchemy trickery and a double head spray gun, you mix the solutions as they hit the glass and that creates a mirror. Is that what it it's is? It's chemistry at its wow. highest level, yeah. Um, oh. It's funny because you know a lot of kids will go, oh, I don't really use any of this. Yeah, yeah. I use so many skills from my school days. Really? Yeah, Leo came to measure up tonight with me and uh, yeah, he's like, oh, that's easy, that is, Dad. But when I'm measuring up for like a splash up in the kitchen, you've got to put pocket in the right place. Yeah. To within a few millimetres, you know. So you've got to be pretty on it. Um, and you do use you do use all those things from school. Yeah. You know what I mean? That they tell you. There's all this shit you don't use. I get that, but you know. Yeah. So yeah. And then I make mirrors look old in different ways by destroying the silver and dissolving it and distressing it. Um, oh. and you sell to some very wealthy people, don't you? Like Arabs and all sorts, don't you? I do send yeah, stuff true. abroad, um, but I do go to the old 20, 20 bedroom mansion quite yeah. a bit, you know. And yeah, I do send to some, some. I was in the Saudi Arabian oh, yeah. embassy last year, which was quite funny because oh, yeah. it was lockdown. So I arrived and there was all the security, the security on the main gate, the security and police and armed police everywhere, the security on every single embassy. And there's like 20 embassies in there, and there's no one there because <laughs> yeah. well, because it was lockdown, so they're all gone home. So there's all this oh. security. But it was yeah, it was um, it was quite a, a, a big job there that, that I did, which was quite interesting. Wow. But those jobs are more of a pain in the ass in a way because you have to use a lift to get up to the floor, and you know. They What's the biggest there. mirror you ever done? I made a mirror that was one point seven by three meters, which is pretty big. Holy shit! Yeah, so we have all that. What happens with them is they bend as you carry them, so you get those glass suckers that you put on, you know, and they can ping off. So you think you've got it and you think the sucker's working, but because the glass is so big, it will actually bend as you move as you're moving it around. So you've got to, yeah, it's carrying glass is actually the biggest challenge when you've got something like that that you've made. What you know? would that have um, 
cost you. Yeah. That, if that had popped, <laughs> um, lots of money. That would have been about two and a half grand. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Any more yeah. questions so, or comments, Rodney? Um, they can't pull house the ankle bone there. It's actually. <laughs> <laughs> it's like dog wars in this house. There's two bears and one of them. What is he barking at now? Put my gravel. Red. Shut up. He's blind. Yeah, go on. How is your ankle? ankle good, Leo? The ankle, I get like, because I got like nerve pains in the top of my foot because, well, I'm not sure what it is, but I'm just totally numb. So they've nicked a nerve whilst we've been the surgery. Oh, really? and that's the yeah, that's the only problem that I have with it. But other than that, movement is amazing, and I I do have to do a little bit of a massage. Did you end up it. seeing that bloke for physio or not? He hasn't yet. No. I haven't yet. I am going to. Mm. He's been told massage to, helps to massage like the, the most, yeah, most. gently, you know. Yeah, massage yeah. helps loads. It like loosens up all the muscles, and it like. Yeah, totally frees up the ankle. Oliver, oh, it's just strength now. I just got to build up strength, mm. innit? Oliver Seven said, "What shoes does Leo wear?" It's usually like Lonsdale's. I right? now now I wear specialized shoes. Specialized yeah. are the ones, and they actually are. So they have sorted out some kit tonight, have they? Yeah, yeah, some specialized kit. They wow. got some nice kit and special measure. Yeah. I bet it's quality, isn't it? Helmets? Yeah, they got huh? Got a helmet as well. Yeah, helmet. Yeah. The yeah, uh, man. Yeah, it's a nice helmet, actually. You'll see it in the next vlog. Vlog. Wow, really? wow we were. Vlog. <laughs> vlog. <laughs> yeah, it is good news. Someone said it's good news that you're on the mend. It, it, it is good news because um, I think when it was cold, you felt the screws in. Oh, yeah, the cold, the cold <laughs> actually does hinder it quite the, a lot. The cold is what you kind so of when you're, you notice it at Dubby because you do the uplift and it gets really cold and then you get to the top and it's like you've just got like a peg leg. I have mine, you know, I have mine removed. Yeah, I know, but mine are in the same spot. Oh, you right. say you don't have them removed. When I when I did mine, I had like a plate in my ankle and like, I don't know, about six screws. Yeah, I haven't got a plate. Ah, right. And I didn't, you don't, you, they quite often leave it on. They would have left mine on for the rest of my life. But someone, I got some advice off someone saying, get it out if you can get it out. So you have to go in and like exaggerate a little bit to the doctor say it's rubbing on your work boots yeah you know, yeah yeah know. yeah that's literally it. That's a month long. later it was gone and do you know what the, the operation to remove the plate literally one two days later i was totally normal again it's so quick the recovery from that yeah you just got like a you're, you're removing the foreign object don't yeah, you yeah. Than it in, i suppose yeah and i, I could think. and that was in winter and you could feel it in yeah. winter yeah. you could feel the cold uh, someone on here said they broke their collarbone which is interesting what you said yeah because What's i that? didn't really when i worked when i worked in care years ago i just would have broke my collarbone they didn't set it they just left it go yeah and my neighbor Stop. broke his a few weeks before and he needed his setting because of his job yeah. and he's never had a problem with it i've got aches now because it sets slightly forward. Oh, really? So I'd always say to try and get them to put something yeah. on it. Mm. Which one is it your collarbone you broke? Uh, no, my no, ankle. Your ankle so broke. Almost yeah. the same, same as yours. split, yeah. Mine was. I broke my collarbone. Yeah, you did. did it was you that broke it, was it? Yeah. I don't really get anything on it. I just got slinging for a bit. Yeah. I, when I crashed, I was lying down and I looked down, you know, on my feet like that, but this foot was pointing that way. And I had like a massive lump sticking out the side. It was nearly a compound fracture. And, oh, yeah. man. and then I got, it was at Forrester D, you know, I stuck on the hip, stuck on the hill for about an hour. I emptied a complete can of that, um, you know, the gas and air. I was totally off my head. Yeah. Laughing at all my mates because I couldn't feel a thing. And then they had to carry me down to the ambulance. And then I was stuck, for some reason, I was stuck at the ambulance at Forrester Dean in the ambulance for like an hour or so where they decided, when they were deciding where to take me. And then they took me to, I think it was Hereford, where they did a, like a, popped it back in. You know, oh, under oh, anaesthetic. Oh, oh. That's and then, the yeah, pop back in. Yeah, that was, I don't even remember any of that. So no, that's a good thing. That dad, <laughs> dad didn't have a YouTube channel or anything then, and as soon as he broke his ankle, the first thing he done was cut his, got his phone out and started making a vlog out of it. Yeah. It was, I, pinned or anything. Yeah, I started filming. They've got phone. that somewhere. I so think. Uh, I searched. I broke my ankle. Yeah. Really? Any, any more comments, questions, Rodney? Um, JD 
Wells, cheers from Golden, Colorado. Wow. I'm jealous. Bloody hell. He's about, commented a few times. I bet your uh, I bet your weather's a bit nicer, right? Right. Colorado, would it be warm over there? Yeah. yeah. It's well, to give you an example. Colorado is where they grow weed everywhere, isn't it? Is it? Yeah. You it's know, like warm twenty four seven over there. Minus one here today, so uh, enjoy that weather. No, yesterday it was minus one. Oh, it was so already. cold. Oh, running to school. Do you get a numb face when you ride to school like, early in the morning? Uh, I, I don't know. I don't. I, don't I, I left school like thirty five years That's ago. What, you, well, you, no, you wouldn't get a numb face. You got bed. Uh, the next vlog is <laughs> on. The they're <laughs> Monday and Thursday. <laughs> And uh, the next vlog, I don't even know what it's going to be. Hopefully, because we're a little bit behind, um, Leo on, first it will be the Leo Freighter first ride. Yeah, right? but you actually have to ride up a hill tomorrow. Yeah, well done. He's <laughs> useless, he is. We you have. We've still got the, the two Afton Bikes vlogs, which we haven't been allowed to release yet. The one where we do the factory visit and the other one where probably we... probably why we're behind. Well, it is why we're behind, and the other one where we do the ride. But I got a date today. It's the eighteenth. Yeah, I know. Eighteenth of January is when their website goes live, and that's when I can start releasing those videos. So then we'll uh, we'll have a little backlog again, which would be nice. Yeah, some good footage. Yeah. Apparently, it's snowing in Colorado. <laughs> oh right, okay. I thought it was one of those places that was always hot. To be honest, because that's you. You only ever see it like that, don't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. Uh, yeah. Enjoy the snow. Yeah. Any more, Rodney? We've got a bit more coming. You today. can read that. I can't read any of that. Yeah, I can read that. Quite easily. Don't it. finish that. Scared. How? I've always had good eyes. Can, can you read not read that. it? I can read that. Well, I'm the only one that can see what's going on. Yeah. Good job of me, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> any more, Rodney? Mallard the Duck. I broke my collarbone a few weeks back, and as I know that Todd has broken it before, any tips on recovering and getting back riding? I was a bit silly with my collarbone and I was riding again in like two weeks. It's and, and it depends on your age, doesn't it? Yeah. The, the, the younger you are, the quicker you'll heal. Uh, if you've got plenty of money, this is the biggest tip I'd give, uh, and that would be to have laser treatment on it. But it is like 250 quid or something. It depends like. how you break it as well. Because I have I broke it like a way that apparently isn't as common where it's like, inwards instead of outwards and they said because of the way i did it or the way it overlapped or something that it it <laughs> it went like my right work race coat cap oh yeah we've got a cap for you Jake. it went, yeah. it was like a solid <laughs> break yeah, it, but then it yeah. healed faster apparently would you like it now yeah go on that's all your bones about it um my, my knees wet hey your dog slobbering on <laughs> Yeah, yeah. I, my other advice I would give with any break uh, is anything to do with bones is plenty of calcium. Yeah. If you have plenty of calcium, it speeds up the recovery. You know, so milk, <laughs> cheese, anything like that. Any more? Uh, yo, heal up, Jim. Polly's on there. She said crazy funny boys. Right, Hello. Polly. Do you want to see my well whilst Dan's gone, I shall try and show you the breakage. I thought you were gonna show you the new trackies then. <laughs> that's that's my normal one. You can see all the veins. And that's me broken one. And it's there that's broken. You see it's all a bit fat and swollen. <laughs> and if I um there you go, try and and it hurts. So yeah, that's where we're at right now. It's a pain in the arse. But well, we'll get there. Done it many a time before. Shut up. Silly little twerp. Have we got some? Um, have we got some more comments? Come on. Um, Leo, what about new sponsor? Jonathan Behair is obviously late on to the line. Why did you do that? Don't throw balls. Oh, I'm sorry. Wires and everything um, all across the floor. With the Terminator. He is. Well, fetus, isn't it? Oh, nice trackies, Jim. Yes. Have you got new trackies? Yes, brand new. From where from? To get uh, Max? No. Sports Direct. Sports Direct. <laughs> Proper pie. Yeah, it's a TK Max. And you can find any. Yeah. It's right I know. Oh, yeah, yeah, I know. I fancy some, some nice jeans. Some nice jeans? Yeah, I was looking online at some called Hedro Co., I think they're called. 
Petroco. Petroco. <laughs> they're handmade up in up in Yorkshire, but they're like so fucking expensive. I looked at the price, it's like, mm, yeah, that. you don't need any clothes as long as you. <laughs> That's weird. But you don't What's need it? anything other than a kangaroo. Don't need any that. clothes, Dad. <laughs> yes. Dog oh, I got the specialised lid. I got the specialised lid. I thought I'd. Oh, oh, that's that's his... oh my god, that was close. There you go. Look, that's his new. Uh... Hey, look, you can't miss the old. That's nice, isn't it? Yeah. Boom, Jim. Double capping, I believe that's the thing. Two hats, better than one. Isn't it? Have a look. Nice fit. Oh. You leave the tags on these days, I believe. Yeah. Yeah, it's all quite. Well, you can sell them. Bit Race cold. So that's nice. That, that is that a specialised yeah. helmet? Yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah. that's smart, isn't it? The colour, like the uh, colours, isn't it? Colours are wrong. It's probably a bit. bit it's just like cool say the way it's made. It's really, really. Do really you not know? That's fine. That's perfect. Perfect for them. Absolutely perfect. Actually, there's something really doing in that. That's really come comfortable. Com- <laughs> I like the colour. Isn't it? Yeah, come from nice. Yeah. yeah. Mm, very nice. It's very smart, isn't it? They don't make really make anything shit, do they? Specialised. I suppose they're not good. Yeah. Really. Nah, they are high quality, but it is expensive. Right, there's a spinning circle. I think they've had a relationship with the factory that make it for many, many years. You know, and some of the brands coming through. Probably don't have that. Maybe it's a good, you know? Yeah. I wonder. Oh, yeah. You can see they got it for a long time, haven't they? They got, yeah. Check it's plugged into the router. They're trying to go with everything, aren't they? So. We had Why are you the tyres on Sorry, money? we had apparently we had a spinny circle then. It might have just been one Yeah. Yeah, possibly. Yeah, I've got the um the new specialised tires on my bike. They look amazing. Like how, properly, like soft compound and like that. How much is that helmet? How much do you sell them for? Oh at least like eight quid. <laughs> I think it's probably like a hundred and twenty or something, wasn't it? It's hundred and forty something like so that. It's similar it? to like a Troy Lee or a yeah, it's hundred. It's a hundred and it's not. Yeah, it's not. It's normal price helmet really for like a good helmet. Mm. But yeah, they're nice and they're light. They're nice. Anything else? Any other comments? Uh, Ashley Bright must have missed it. Where's your tooth actually gone, Liam? Oh, it's at home on the side. I uh, got <laughs> headbutted by uh, my dog. But, yeah. It wasn't Don't like... Don't to whip it. How can a whip it hurt you from nah, they, he you? gets really excited and I'll literally do zoomies and just run around full pace to the living room. Zoomies? And I'll just... Yeah. Don't know what they are. Is that a Leo word? No, no that's like a yeah. massive thing. That's a massive thing. Oh, what do whippies do? Like, go all hyper. My yeah. dog's going zoomy. Do you know what English bull terrier do? Bill doesn't do know what they call the English bull terrier when they spin round. They call it the bully run. Yeah, really? <laughs> the English Bull Terriers do it. They, they run, they'll run from there to here, flat out, spinning all the way around. It looks hilarious. That's and Bill anything follows that's his in tail. the way just gets you smashed. Just get smashed yeah. Yeah, they don't care, yeah. Bill yeah. follow his tail, right? Or chase his tail. There we go, Race Co. Thank you for helping our boy. Good uh our boy. Our boy. <laughs> Jib <laughs> crew, isn't it? We need to get all, all, all <laughs> we need to get all Jib Crew sponsored up, don't we? <laughs> Uh, Todd, how's the rock shocks? That people, I put the old picture of my bike on from like no, when shit. I first Someone got it. Like and found it. And those <laughs> people think it's my new bike. It's not his new bike. It's my bike when I first Get got it. it. His new bike. It, right? We were hoping the new bikes will be here in January, but from speaking to him the other day, it looks like February. But beggars can't be choosers, so you know. Oh. I'm, the I'm not complaining. I feel a bit more sorry for Todd because he's actually outgrown his bike. He's an inch taller than me. And uh, on he's on a medium. But I was thinking, actually, Todd, just you, ride. why don't you just borrow my bike yeah. while I'm not riding? Hey? Yeah, just put his... Can I put my stuff on it? Yeah. Why don't you just put your shock and perhaps see if we can get a uh, just a different spring off JTEC for now? Yeah, probably get a spring for 30, 40 quid. Yeah. I've got thousands of springs, Jim. Yeah. <laughs> I <I'd laughs> literally do have a bag of springs. Yeah. yeah. One of them will do, I'm sure. Out of a big pen. <laughs> yeah, out of a big pen, yeah. It's about the size yeah. you need for it. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I'll go to the gym now. 
Beast. Your hench. Yeah, proper hench. Man man. went to the gym twice. Liz now you're doing meal plans, mate. I'm not doing meal plans. Yes, you were. Yeah, yeah. yeah. One, yeah. one, yeah. one yeah. thing. Pasta and it has to be four lunches. Not one yeah. thing we've done, and well, we I've done it in the recovery. Is this year I've decided to join a gym. And we've joined like the poshest one in Shrewsbury, the the Shrewsbury Club, which is like sixty pound a month, mad. and it is so nice. It's got like a posh uh, area where you've got a swimming pool, sauna, steam room, right, and yeah. jacuzzi, all state of the art equipment. You know, even like, you know, like the static machines you do all that shit on. Yeah. It's got yeah. like a screen. And then you've got like a sort of have like an up and down bit going like that. And you'll have That's a dot. Rep. And you'll have a dot. And you have to keep the dot in that. Like, it's almost it? like a little road. Right. And it's like keeping a car in the road. And if you can keep that in, then you're doing it absolutely perfectly. And I've never seen that on those machines before. It's got them on loads. Yes, yeah, so that's how hard you work then, is it? You've got to keep well, it's, them it's more, no, it's more uh, doing your repetitions right. and right. good timing. It's really, it's quite clever. Yeah, it's cool. We place. ripped them, mate. Yeah. We ripped. Hopefully. For the summer. Um, yeah. Summer board gym. Yeah. <laughs> we'll get you. Wow. You're going to have to get yourself a pinned vest. <laughs> we've, got a, we've got, a, got one. You got one. Yeah. You? If you ever roll to Colorado, give me a shout, Hammerheads. Okay, okay dude. Okay. Thank you very much. Sure, we'll be getting up there soon. We'll stop. We'll let it stop snowing. I think. Yeah. Really Oliver <laughs> Seven, have you been in contact with Tommy C. Hope recently? No, but I just looked. His latest video has just come out, and he's he was at Kersus. Yeah, he did the uplift there. Did he? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I spoke to him about two or three weeks ago and I think he's buying my roof tent off me in this month he did say so let's see if he does Doris Gamer 1963 Leo Freighter please slap Todd thank you Leo no Doris Gamer <laughs> I will slap him no, you won't. give me your arm I'll slap you your arm and I've got a bit of duck caught in my tooth yeah that'll really, be there for no, a few days really <laughs> oh, oh, scratch your helmet already oh. Idiot. Nice one. Well, I'm not afraid to crash. That's a good thing. You need uh you definitely need some pin stickers on that as well. I need an busy frame on it. Why? An busy frame hand. <laughs> busy frame. Do you know how much that would cost? It's so Taking expensive. Piss, I can shrink wrap it at work, so like, <laughs> yeah. it. Um, can can mirror it. it. I can mirror it. Yeah. I need some nice stickers on that Where is Daniel the Jibbin Gibbon? Where is Daniel? Daniel Gibbons, I don't know. I've seen him at school today. Um, Are you going to ride with him tomorrow? Might well, you're sitting on the bench down, down, by the, down, down, down by the main road. Definitely not. Cause yeah. Cause yeah. Nice road. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think it was it. <laughs> Poor lad. Little man broke his phone. We lost all contact with him for like a day. <laughs> yeah, you were all panicking, weren't you? Wondering where he was. What? Who? With Daniel? Yeah. yeah. Really? He broke his phone and now he's got like an iPhone SE that's about that big and it's like a toy. Oh, God. <laughs> what's, uh, what's that off Kai McNally? That looks like a long one. Found out one of the guys at work does mountain biking today and he asked, do I want to buy his bike because he prefers road really? biking as it's easier. Do you reckon a good slap will sort him out <laughs> or would an uppercut work better? Uppercut, probably. <laughs> um... Leave him to it. Let him go on the road bike because people like that are best away from mountain biking anyway. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think if I lived in a hot country, I'd I'd probably I'd use a road if bike. I lived if in you the, lived in a country with roads that you could yeah, ride on, the Alps. Training, if I lived in the Alps, with nice roads, you yeah, just disappear down all the potholes from yeah, yeah. the drains. Don't yeah. You? <laughs> but only for training. I couldn't imagine doing road biking as a main hobby. I don't know. It's like so shit. I'd do it in the Alps because, mm. like, the views and the roads. Yeah. Um, but... Have you seen that video that's knocking about online at the moment with that road biker who's doing, like, absolutely flat out around all these turns downhill and he's doing 70 mile an hour? It's I've seen them so on Instagram. Gnarly. Has he got his? Is he skidding as well? He no, he's just there? like totally on the limit, right? Like nearly in the edges of the turns. Wowzers! Um, Optimistic on Dovey. Oh, <laughs> lad! I literally I don't know how you see it. Optimistic I, on. I can't. All I can see is that dog emoji. I don't even know that's a dog emoji. <laughs> <laughs> Opinions on Dovey. It's amazing. The only, our only problem with Dovey is because we've locked the right. Yeah, we. 
Todd and I are looked after by them because they're friends of ours and obviously they like us doing the videos so we don't have to pay. And now you're kind of sponsored by them as in you can go there. Yeah, right. But I kind of don't want to go too much because I don't want all my vlogs to be from Dobby because people will get soon get bored and turned off. So uh, We need to do some Dobby off soon, I reckon. I'll do some gravel biking down the lane. Yes, that'd be fun. Really I think I found Dovey compared to sort of oh, it's the best bike compared to revs. I mean, I rode, I rode my e-bike at, 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 and you can ride an e-bike at Dovey. Mm. I, I found it really hard to ride my e-bike at revs. It was it's just very tacky. It's a very different. Yeah, feel, very jumpy it? and tacky. Yeah, mm. yeah, yeah. A routine. Tacky, you know, but I built it. Yeah, I built the camera. Yeah, but I advertise that. Yes, we have a. Capra, it's actually XO1 build with XDR brakes. Uh, I think we're selling it for 1.8. 1.8, yeah. Yeah, get to us. It's Is yeah, it a large? A CF, Capra CF Pro. Yeah, carbon. Size large. And it's rent full and kitted out. It is nice kitted out ones. nicely. To that will do my tooth. Yeah. Yeah. No, That's just stuck been tooth, fully right. rebuilt, fully greased up. Everything is running mint on it at the moment. So, yeah. I don't really want to sell it. Is it a large or a medium? Hey. What's it a large? It's a large. So are you full e bike now then? A large. Do you um, need to get a down a bike. I'd like to get a down a bike in the future for white bikes. But to be honest, I went to Dovey and like that guy was saying there, what opinion is on Dovey, and I just I had a really good half a day up there yeah. on the e bike. The, the trail was fast enough, there was enough room for the e bike. Do you know what I mean? It was tacky mm. enough. I didn't need any more, you know. So it I feels a bit I... weird putting your e bike on a trailer to go to the top. Yeah, I yeah. can't quite get used to that. It's a bit of a you know double edged sword, isn't it? It's like, well, why am I doing this? But at least with Dovey, you haven't got another option. No, and when you get to the top at Dovey, you've got a good half a mile where you've got pedaling to do anyway, mm -hmm. haven't you? On some yeah. of the trails, and you can hit stuff a lot quicker, which you need to. Yeah, so um, I haven't been to bike park Wales on an e bike yet. It, yeah, it's when you good. Dovey, yeah. I saw yeah. another man on an e bike who caught him up when you know when. Race track merges with Swooper, Dad. Yes. Just before the jump, so I was shouting at the skis and shouting shit at him, going, Daniel Freighter. And I got to the bottom, and Daniel Freighter was looking at me, going, Where were you? And there's just this random old key, so I thought, so Oh, I bet he thought you were right, twat. <laughs> So let me show you what you can win tonight. I nearly forgot. It's very hard to know. And too, actually, it'd be in like it ten minutes. Um, it's quite a good, quite a good giveaway tonight, folks. Yeah. Not a race go hat. This we have here um, an Evoc hip pack. One I used to use. Uh, I've got the bladder, and I've got the. Um, the pipe thingy for it as well, which will go in that. I have got here a blanket, a nice jumper by Extreme Culture. It's got a t shirt in it, it's not meant to be in it. You're not having a t shirt. What it? makes that? That's oh, my Envy t shirt. You're definitely not having that. Um, it is All by good. Extreme Culture, basically a jumper. Um, a set of nice ergon jumper. grips there, the downhill grips there, uh, loads of stickers, including pin stickers. We have a nice Lizine. Yeah, that's <laughs> smart, that is. That's a like uh, that. battery. You can't come with that. Hey, <laughs> carry on. Dan. That is a battery um, digital bike pump. <laughs> Whatever. And uh, finally, we have a one of your FSRB stem caps. Stem caps. So it's quite a good thingy. So we will be giving that away in about 10 minutes. Something like that. And a dog as well. Yeah, and a board terrier. You, you're choosing. <laughs> Any of them. Just get rid of them. I like his board to board. You all right, boy? You all right, boy? You're right, boy. You're right, boy. You're right. That's right. We'll have to bring the whip round here one night, won't we? Yeah. yeah I've we'll actually um, whip, I've actually messaged Ben Pledge, who does MTB Strength Factory tonight, Todd, because he did get in about touch about stuff, yeah. about a programme for me and you. And let's see if he gets back to us. I think you should ask him for one for me, please. Yeah, someone <laughs> as, as I can read. Oh, yeah, someone really cool. yeah, someone has got back into biking after many years. Yeah, yeah. 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 say the name. 
Um, are, I suppose you are. Residing. Residing. Yeah. I was getting back into biking out of many years. I would you recommend a 27.5 or 29 for trails like East Ridge, Hopton, Nescliff? I am not a huge guy, five foot nine. I was thinking 27. 27 might be best probably. For me. Yeah. Uh, 27 or mullet. If you're buying and you have the option for mullet at that height, I would go mullet. If you're not if, in it for speed, then 27 might. Right. Yeah, probably. You'll have you'll always you'll have, have better more. rolling speed on a twenty nine, but at five foot nine, you'll have more fun. You get more, limit, the aren't there, really? you get more out of the trail on a twenty seven, don't you? Yeah, yeah, I think East Ridge has some pretty tight, twisty trails. Yeah, like yeah. That. So the twenty seven would work better. Twenty seven would work probably better. Yeah. yeah. But the guy underneath saying that a lot of trees around are down up some of those trails, and they are, aren't they? Yeah. Uh, East Ridge isn't too bad. <laughs> some of the trails have been ruined. Did you did you see? Um, They've opened, uh, which one was it? It, it? The Golfies been opened again. Which one? Um, IXS, Gold Run, Flat, no, Carry oh, On. Look at him. Um, Cresta. No. Um, Waterworld, I think Water. it was. Oh, yeah. yeah, I'm naming in it's not laughing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So well done to those trail builders. That's awesome. We yep. didn't ride Waterworld last time. We did one climb up. Well, that's because you it. don't ride Waterworld. You slide it. Have you ridden up there? No. You've never ridden. I'm going to do the EWS. Mm. You need to go up before. Well, um, um, hey, I'll tell you what's in February. The caravan, camping and motorhome show. Well, oh, pikey That's show. I'm going to go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm going to go and see what's... Uh, we did it. Have, have, have another go. Let's do a Flag something. That's a good idea, yeah. yeah. Why not? But I'm going to be a bit more realistic this time. Go for caravans rather than motorhomes. I, I think you go double decker no, bus. Let's go off on a double decker yeah. bus. I think yeah. that's the way forward. The pinned black <laughs> double decker bus. It's got yeah, yeah we'll buy Luther's bus. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, Todd, any chance some fresh membership emojis for this year? Yeah, I've slapped a bit on them. You know, when people pay for the membership, they get them free emojis, the match ones. I haven't made any new ones. Right, well, you've got to do that this week. All right. That is the deal, or no more sponsorship. <laughs> I'm ending your sponsorship, Cod. Yes. Uh, look on TVTA Insta what they've done to repeat offender. Tweed Valley Trail Association. I'm assuming that is. Oh, I'll have a look at that. I'm going to have a look at that. What else is there? Doris Garner's off to um, Red Bull Rampage, apparently. Yeah, Doris Game at yeah. 1963. I'm thinking of entering Red Bull Rampage. What do you think about that, Leo? No, I'm going to do it. He's going to do it one day. I'm he just said he's almost do it. ready. Mm. Yeah, Jim just sinks a few more weeks on the bike. Yeah, just need to get my hand on. better. A bit, a few more, tra- a few more trips to Horman. Get my hand Think better. Get away. He lose about thirty <laughs> years and um, like about. 10 times my skill. Yeah. I think the first thing before you go there is you probably need to go to some kind of soft, um, you know, the ballpark things where you yeah. can jump into yeah. something that, that, yeah. that is a nice landing, you know. I mean, some of the air they get there is just medicine, yeah. isn't it? Sure. Medicine. I'm afraid I'd like to see you at a trampoline park. Do you want to go? Oh, that's, what, sorry? That's in the Do you want to go to a trampoline park? A trampoline park? Yes. Yeah. I've seen, one, I've seen him at days. a trampoline park. It's it's what else we got, Rodney? I'm sure there's some more stuff. Um, I'm you, getting there, Jim. Someone's put. I'm going there. I'm going oh. there. Right. Um, that is now it goes. I wouldn't bother riding Brindred anytime soon. It's totally ruined from the high winds. Yeah, I went Hopton last week and it was knackered on most of the tracks because of the winds. Yeah. Trees down. It's so annoying with the I did Cody street. Brennan, you know, the beast up there. And there were four trees down that you really couldn't get around. Really? And they're just not really. And they look like and they look like they've been there a long time as well. So they're obviously I find it and I know it's all rules and regulations and they've got to do it, but I find it so annoying that someone like myself, who's got a chainsaw certificate and insurance and everything. I can't go onto forestry land. That's because you're not free out of the, out of the <laughs> way. I think you'll find mean? your mental stability yeah. is the problem. <laughs> the doctors said, don't yeah. let that bucket yeah. anywhere near. They won't even let me have an electric toothbrush. What can I cut down with this? <laughs> no, you're right that you can't go and, uh, and do it, I think. It's, it's uh, just 
PC. The thing world. is, it's getting to the tree, isn't it? Because yeah. the one that I was on Uncle Festival, I think, and I thought, how would you even get to this tree? Yeah. To be honest, to drag it out of the woods, but you've only got to cut a channel out. Of yeah, it, you have. Yeah, I mean, somewhere like Eastridge, I mean, it'd be dead simple, but it would be. Yeah. yeah. We've got yeah. some new stuff coming up, Eastridge soon. Have they? You can get ETB Ah. Mm. What, they're actually legitimate? They're actually going to do some digging for us? 98, getting all new rock. Oh, yeah. Like About the time I'm not started. Oh, new tracks. Wow. That yeah. might have been secret, actually. But... <laughs> Never mind. Have you guys had any <laughs> snow or torrential rain? No. We had about 10 minutes of snow when we went to Eastridge. Yeah, yeah. It, it's just so cold. Tuesday. It's like it's like um that weather when you go out and instantly your face <laughs> is completely numb <laughs> like literally your nose just goes completely numb and your ears it's not even like it's not wet is it uh, no, it's, it's just so like been cold. Absolute, it's been horrible at work yeah. absolutely horrible it's like a monster it's like a miniature monster yeah it's a little bit like someone from star wars yeah right? <laughs> well, no, he's just a daniel dog isn't he i've never <laughs> seen a dog get so obsessed with licking his own paws Let's just pull them away from the damn pool. You'll have to put a chainsaw in the rucksack next time, Lee Jones. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. <laughs> no face, no case. Get them trees out, Jim. Yeah. <laughs> no cameras in the woods. Yeah, no cameras in the woods, yeah. yeah. Have you ridden the new blue canic? Yeah, the new canic. Yeah. Didn't there was one. We might have. How long has it been up there for? Because we did go recently. Are you thinking of going there tomorrow? Nah. Where are you going? going up there now. Well, we're going tomorrow, so, but the weather's looking really, pretty really dire tomorrow. Really bad. Yeah, it's looking pretty bad. I want to ride to my gnarly on the new bike. I don't know where, though. Really? I wanted to go bury ditches, you know. Yeah. Uh, I imagine if there's um, a lot of trees down at Hopton and that, yeah, it'll be yeah. bad there. Like. Mm. No Hopton. I'm trying to think where the blue starts at, um, at Canna. I'm sure that's the that's problem with mountain biking, isn't it? With um, when you get these high winds and storms, it's like almost everywhere you go to is surrounded by trees. It doesn't take that long, though, because all the little trail pixies come out and fix it. <laughs> <laughs> go yeah. Ponty Corner for a video. We need yes, to there. we do. You can do uplifts there. It's like gone, though, pretty sure. Yeah. We can ben was there, didn't Yeah, Ben was there. Yeah, my brother was there. He said it was pretty good. Where? Yeah, Pontypool. Pontypool, yeah. Really? Yeah, yeah. 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 The yeah. corners yeah. just look amazing. Uh, for those of you watching who I didn't mention it before or didn't hear me, if you want to buy some InvisiFrame, use the code PINNED15 and you'll get 15% off. And if you're getting InvisiFrame oh, for your complete bike, oh, as in like frame protection, like that's some good money. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> it's the new race cycles. Mascot, <laughs> you're right there. Oh my god, it's <laughs> amazing! Yeah, like it's really it's a of stuff. Yeah, can you not get him on the, the camera? Shop. He looked really reggae in that. Get him on the uh, portrait. Do you remember when you first met Ian? Yeah, we saw yeah. yeah. <laughs> he did look completely like Bob Marley. <laughs> right. Keep your head still. Oi, Ponty Pool is made of trash. It suits you. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Oh, yeah. That would be good on a uh, <laughs> story, actually. Yeah, it's been yeah. there a few months, less than a year, I think. I don't know what he's on about, but yeah, I had an electric head trimmer poking up he head trimmer, <laughs> head, head trimmer, <laughs> head trimmer po poking out of my back a few months ago. Forgot I had it and yeeted myself off the bike with a branch. Oh, um, nasty. Clarks and MTV. Right, yeah, that, that would hurt. I have like hit, yeah. You know when you like jump up and you misjudge and you hit your head on a branch. I've done that a few times, like riding. It's horrible. Mm. I the most recent one I ever that was when me, you, and Gary went up Eastridge night riding, and I forgot that I've got. A you got that, light yeah, it's a bit like when you got a GoPro on the got top. A, a <laughs> big branch pull <laughs> head back with the light. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's done yeah. it. Right, it's nine o'clock, so we're going to do the giveaway. I've already thought of a question, actually, and it's one that nobody oh, will actually it. know. So is it a guess? It, well, no, no it, it could be an educated guess. So we have, and you've got, I'd say you've got a, um, 
Well, you've got a 33.3% chance of getting it right if you know all three. Out of our three channel sponsors, which one have we been with the longest? Oh, blindness. Now, they're the channel sponsors, uh, the Let's ones who give us money. <laughs> Looks a drip. No, Todd. Oh God, God. Uh, Fenwick. Oliver Seven, it's you, Fenwicks. What's this? Ethan Fletcher, it's not Fenwiz. <laughs> Oliver Seven, it's you. What's this? It's the giveaway. It is the channel sponsor we have been with the longest. Oh right. And it is Fenwicks. And uh, well done, Oliver Seven. Give us, well send done. us a email message with your address to Jim at pintv.co.uk, and you've won Let's that. Go. One. <laughs> well done, excellent. He's so done all right there. Race no, cycle. I swear, I swear, you won like the uh, Evo one. Hey, did he win the Evo one? Oliver Seven. No idea. <laughs> Like tech. <laughs> <laughs> I can never remember if someone's won something before. But if they have, then fair play to them. Because there's no... Um, that's not about... Or wasn't about internet speed, that one, was it? It was about yeah. guessing. Nobody would have known that. No. I bet you didn't even know that, didn't you, Todd? Whether it was M or RLP. No. Nah, because they were quite close together. It took me a minute, but I knew it was... Mm. Fenwiz. Yes. Uh, I used it. I used the change the other day. Good, I've not used any of that, and I was well amazed. It's just a rough bit of sponge, but because it's so rough, it fetches. Some if you serious grind. when the, when it's and really the the when it's sense. really shitty, the or if brilliant. you haven't done it for a while in summer mm. and you know they go black. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you use the degreaser, then the brush, then the foaming chain cleaner, and that sponge, it literally comes out like brand oh, new. Wow. Yeah, yeah, amazing. Yeah, what? Yeah. Mm -hmm. You made me feel nervous about your existence. Look at him with his brain. There's a new brush in there. What? I haven't even got one there. Have you? Beat me too. Do you want to buy it? 20 quid. No, I'm all right. I'll get one. What's that? What? Shush talking is not for you. So, guys, thank you very much for what muck for watching. Um... Keep your eyes peeled. More it. vlogs. We'll try and, even with the hand, I'll try and keep up with the Monday and Thursday <laughs> deadlines. Um, let's see how we go. Is that is that a comment right there, Todd? <laughs> <laughs> is it safe? Yeah, yeah, yeah. um, <laughs> Rogue One clip the other day for the first time. <laughs> Rogue One reached out hardtail. That was fun. We need to go back to One Cliff. Well, I bet it's gnarly One Cliff on a hardtail. Oh, hello. Cuddling. Oh, hello. That's such a chunk. Such a chunk. Oh, you know how Yeah. He doesn't buy Right. Okay. Thanks for watching, guys. And we will see you in a couple of weeks for another live see show. You later. Love you. <laughs> right. Love you all. Oh, no. It wasn't on the end. Oh, my. Oh, boy's doing things wrong. Love you. This man can't oh, even... Wow.